Hey, good afternoon, guys. This has been a great day. Um, started out, I went into town. I had to go get a food box, me and my wife did. And, um, man, those four salvation letters are gone, and I, I prayed so hard about that. It's like, God, please let somebody find them that really needs it. My hair. Huh? Um, and they were gone. So, uh, praise God. Um, I want to say that uh, to all the watchmen and watchwomen, I got to do a shout out here for Granny, Global Rapture Watchers, Chris, Kim Fisher, uh, Tom Coates. Man, you guys have helped me so much. And you guys on the comments, in those, um, in the comments have helped me so much. And um, I, I heard the Father tell me, your channel, I will bring them to you, right? And this was maybe a month ago. I had one, two, three people watching videos. And um, I pray that, you know, people come to this channel because I will preach the good news every day. And if I know God's in control, you know, I put my faith and trust in him. And if they don't come here, they're going to go to somebody that's truthful. So it's a win-win. I just pray to God that they don't go to someone bad that uh, says you can lose your salvation or God's going to be like, oh, you're not my child anymore because that just seems like so something that God would do, right? No, he wouldn't. <laughs> but I, I'm so blessed, brothers and sisters. It is, I hope it's okay that I call you my beloved brothers and sisters because you are. And uh, I really love you guys. I have a strong love in my heart. Do you know that there's actually 20 gifts as Christians that we can have when we um, accept Jesus into our heart and accept the Holy Spirit? Well, I think mine is service and um, giving. And, uh, oh gosh, there's another one. If somebody has an idea of all those 20 uh, gifts I might find them and make a video of that but um, I really want to thank you guys man if anybody has any prayers I have a list of prayers I love praying for people it's the Holy Spirit in me not me because if I didn't have the Holy Spirit I'd probably be like uh, I'm not praying for you no I don't know <laughs> but you know what I mean and you can put your prayers in the comments and I'd love to pray for you um, let's say a prayer right now. Um, Father God, I come to you this afternoon. I, we want to pray for all the lost that are Jewish, our Jewish brothers and sisters, our Greek brothers and sisters. And we pray that they come to you, Father, through the Holy Spirit. And we pray for peace in Jerusalem and Israel. We also pray that the enemy shall not prosper against Israel and Jerusalem or America or any other country. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. See, just a short prayer that I think is powerful. And all you guys got to do is say amen. And you're in that prayer. When two or three are gathered, what happens? Psh, prayers are answered. <laughs> I love you guys so much. And... Um, if you guys could possibly keep me and my wife in your prayers, uh, we're living in a mold infested apartment. Um, I mean, it's rough. Uh, it's under our sink. So what I did was I took some foam, cut it and, and covered the couplings everywhere. Well, the first couple of days it wasn't so hot. It was good, but now it's starting to just, I mean, it's a little warmer today and yesterday we could smell it just fuming right out of our uh, sink and um, it's really messing with my wife and me which I don't I really don't care what it does to me and I shouldn't say that but I don't want to make her sick uh, I get headaches and stuff but I just watched on uh, what was it Randy K this lady died from mold um, and I've been in such a bad predicament. I've tried to get a job everywhere and it's so bad. I got so spiritually attacked. And I, the last job I had, I was at a factory over here in Elwood, Kansas. And um, 
we were doing cow tags and you melt the plastic well the plastic smoke was coming right into my face and I couldn't breathe and I'm telling you the only jobs around here that they'll even hire me because I had a felony from seven years ago well, a felony from nine years ago now okay and some jobs still won't hire me so I literally just tapped out and I've been praying praying to God for forgiveness because I know getting disability it was a hard thing for me my wife talked me into it but she's right you know I can't get any kind of love going to a job and and see I'm the type of guy that I want to work but here it is my wife has excuse me my wife has uh, two of her big toes missing and now has a, a bruise like this big on the bottom of her foot from wearing a bad pair of shoes that she don't have a lot of shoes to wear and uh, if you guys could just keep pray for uh, Austin's wife, Mamie, that's her name, M-A-M-I-E. Uh, if you could just pray for her healing, um, I really, really appreciate it, guys. Uh, um, I want to do a shout out to my awesome dad, Tim Miller. He's my world father, you know, my father down here, <laughs> not our father, but uh he's been such a good awesome dad to me and uh you know he lost his wife some years back maybe eight or nine years ago in uh, 2013 and that was my mom you know and um i started out as a jehovah witness with my mom and dad Ooh, yeah and let me tell you what i learned a little bit of the word in there but the holy spirit was not in the bible they actually cut the Holy Spirit out and um, try to say Jesus was uh, Michael's brother and that's all he was. He wasn't the Savior. He wasn't, yeah. So, I mean, I literally, uh, well, I've known Jesus and been searching for him since probably 10 years ago, like right after my mama died when I was in prison. And, uh, yeah, so, but it was weird because... I'm I don't blame my dad or mom or anything for taking me there because uh, I did get I, it's kind of like I took the meat and spit out the bone of that religion was it the wrong religion yes yes it was I mean they didn't preach the blood of Jesus Christ uh, they they don't even know if they're going to heaven number two uh, Jehovah is everything yes but who can know the father only Jesus Christ and if you don't know Jesus you don't know the Father because he is the way the truth the life that sets us free so um, but yeah please guys if anybody has any prayers they're hurting they're feeling sick feeling anxiety um, what I like to do personally I go onto Tom's page global rapture washers my brother Chris's step uh, Tom Coates, uh, Granny, my awesome Granny, and she is our Granny in Christ. So you guys seen her? I'm telling you, she rocks. But I go on there. I haven't did a lot of prayers on hers yet, but I did like three or four. And um, it's just the Holy Spirit in me. Like, guys, you know this. After you get saved, and it, you're not doing it for your salvation, running over here, running over there, praying over here, praying over there, praying over there. No, you're doing it. It's the Holy Spirit doing it, not us, right? So I just want to say that. You guys want to say hi to my cat? Please tell me if she's pregnant, because I'm praying not really. But if she is, my wife hates cats. But um, I pray that she's not pregnant. Check this out, though. Here's Whiskers. She looks like Funzie, my old cat. That, Yeah. Whiskers. Whiskey. Whisker, whiskey, kitty, 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 whiskers, whiskers, whiskers. <laughs> She's a trip, ain't she? All right, guys, I pray. I'm going to get off here, and I'm going to pray that people watch this video. Please like, subscribe, and share. You don't have to, but um, I did hear an audible voice in my head say, Austin, I'm going to bring them to your channel. And so far, he's brought a lot to him. I love you guys so much. Um, like I said, please comment if you're feeling sick or anxiety. Anything, it don't matter. 
I love you guys so much. Keep looking up. Oh, the 28th, uh, Yom Kippur. It is the next highest watch date. 28th to the 29th is Yom Kippur. And um, <clears throat> uh, Moses, when he went up to get the Ten Commandments and came back down, that was Yom Kippur. And then he went back up again to talk to the Father again, Yom Kippur. So it's kind of like judgment. And by the way, I've been seeing 1111 every single day, except for today I've seen 555, which is grace, God's grace. Thank God. I hope you guys have a good day. Please um, like, subscribe, and share if you feel led to. You don't have to. I'm not doing this for money. I'm doing it because I love you guys, and I love Jesus, and I want to glorify him. That's it. Love you guys. Have a great day. Keep looking up in Jesus' name. Amen. Love you.